William McCray. I came tonight to speak to the voters and the taxpayers of West Palm Beach. There is an election coming up this month that is critically important to the city. The mayor's administration and her office has been a failure to the citizens of West Palm Beach, a complete failure. Myself and other whistleblowers for years have come here and exposed corruption and many problems in the city. We didn't do it because we had an ax to grind or we had an agenda. We did it because we care about the city and the citizens and the taxpayers and the voters in this city. We do care about them. And there's been a lot of lies and rumors going around. And at the last city commission meeting, I was really offended because people's families were attacked. Commissioner Matero is not running for office, and yet her family was attacked. She's not even running for office. Um, Mr. Fincy, who I only know to be an honorable man's family, was attacked. And it, it, it was disgraceful. Um, I could have attacked the mayor's family. I could have attacked Commissioner James' family. I didn't do that. Others could have done the same. But I didn't want to stoop to that level, which was extremely low, extremely low. Um, there's many endorsements for the mayor that she's received because she's still for the status quo. She's still upholding all of the big businesses, and, and she's not for the taxpayer or the common person. When you live in a multi-million dollar home, and you're not even from the state of Florida, how can you understand a working class, working person who earns a nine to five job? You cannot comprehend it, you can't understand it when your house is up for sale for 2.5 million or whatever it was. That is not a regular person. She does not understand your values and your morals. She's not even from the state. She hasn't been here very long. It's, it's a shame. And uh, there's a lot of lies that have been going around about commit Commissioner Mitchell privatizing everything. That couldn't have even been brought to the floor without the mayor allowing it. That's a lie. Commissioner Mitchell does want to form some partnerships with the private sector, which I think is a good thing for everyone. So there's a lot of lies that have been going around to the black employees in the city, and I want to correct that. It's lies. That's exactly what it is. And Commissioner James has done nothing to advance African Americans in this city. Nothing at all. He sat there. Now that it's election time, he wants to say what he wants to do for the African American community. I say that we need to make a point. We need to vote the mayor out. We need to vote Commissioner James out so that the next people who get on this dais will understand that if they don't represent us, don't come to us when it's election time. Don't come to us crying. The quid pro quo, the incumbents need to go. These two right here need to be voted out. It's disgraceful what's been happening to the African American community, indeed to the entire citizenry of West Palm Beach. Thank you, Mr. McCray.